What up traders, this is Cam from Investors Underground. So I'm gonna be talking a little bit about short selling today. So unless you wanna be a jockey or you're an aspiring midget wrestler, there are a few careers in the world where you can make cash just being short. Being short when trading, however, has absolutely nothing to do with your height. And I thought I'd spend a little time uh, with you guys to talk to you about the short side of trading and explain a world of the stock market that a lot of people don't understand. So first of all, I guess it's obvious to start with what everyone knows about stocks. You buy some shares, you wait for the price to go up and you sell them for a profit. This buy and sell kind of uh, strategy is called longing and it has nothing to do with the length of time that you're holding the shares. It's about the direction that you want the price to go. Longing stocks is great if you think the price is gonna go up, but what happens if you think the price is gonna go down? You can make money from that too, uh, by something called shorting or short selling. The concept of shorting can confuse uh, a lot of people, but I'm hoping that uh, I'll be able to talk you guys through it now. So let's say you borrow some shares of a company from your broker and you sell them straight at market value. So you borrow them and immediately you hit the sell button. You receive money in your account for selling the shares, but you owe the broker the number of shares that you borrowed from them. Right? So you have to repay the number of shares that you borrowed. When the price goes down, you buy the shares at a lower price and give them back. You get to keep the dollar amount difference and that's your profit. So uh, maybe that's a little confusing for some of you, but uh, I'll give you an example. Let's say you borrow 100 shares of company XYZ and uh, you immediately sell them at $150 a piece. So 100 shares times $150, there's 15 grand. So you've got 15 grand in your hand, but you need to give your broker back 100 shares of XYZ. And uh, let's say you wait a couple of hours and XYZ shares go down from $150 each to $110 each. You go and buy those 100 shares back at $110 each, and then it costs you $11,000. The $15,000 of cash you got from selling them minus the $11,000 that you used to pay them back after the price went down equals $4,000 of profit that's sitting in your account. So that's probably enough uh, for a big night out at Vegas. Short selling is a real great tool uh, in the trading belt because it means you can make money regardless of the broader economic conditions. So if uh, stocks are going down, you can make money by shorting. If stocks are going up, you can make money by longing. It's a real great tool to have in your belt. It's something that I uh, personally uh, really like to do. Um, it's the side of trading that I generally favor. So uh, below is a chart uh, from a great day. I had uh, shorting Amazon. Uh, this was a little while ago, as you can see by the price. But the little red arrows represent where I shorted and the green arrows represent where I bought to cover. And uh, I did a bunch of trades. It was pretty much scalping every time. It, uh, it looked like it was cracking. I, I incorporated this with the level two and some of the time and sales uh, to sort of get my entries and exits. I made 18 trades, I think in two hours and uh, they're all profitable. So you can see the price is going down and uh, that's great when you're on the short side. So if you've got any more questions, uh, you can hit me up. Uh, I'm at cam at investorsunderground.com. Um, I'm gonna stick a bunch of links in the description where you can get more information uh, and watch some more free content. But uh, yeah, this has been Cam from Investors Underground. Good luck trading.